Hey everyone, it's been a while since I've made a video. I'm kind of just winning this one. I've been noticing a lot of people, not a lot, but like some people kind of interested in playing this game. It's called uh, Myth of Empires. And I want to show you how I made a server for it. It's actually quite easy, but there seems to be like a lot of confusion. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and show you the program I used. It's called Windows GSM. Uh, once you download it and run it, it's going to just look like this. Um, to get Myth of Empires running on here, uh, you're going to need to go to GitHub, and then there's going to be a Myth of, Empire, a lot, Myth of Empires plugin, and get to code, download zip, and then once you've got all that, I have all the links for these below, uh, once you've got all that, go into your Windows GSM, click the little puzzle icon down here, import plugin. And then it'll ask you to import a zip file. Just import the zip file that you just downloaded. Should be in your downloads folder. And now you're going to want to click servers and install game server. And now Myth of Empire should be an option. Uh, the plugin basically just lets you now use Myth of Empire's server on this. Now, if you're new to server hosting and stuff, you're going to need to port forward. This may be confusing for some. I will go ahead and show you exactly how to do it. Uh, this is with your firewall. This is not with your router. If you need router, that's going to be specific to your router. So we're going to port forward through a firewall. Go ahead and just open up your Windows search bar. Type in firewall. It should say Windows Defender Firewall with Advanced Security. Open that. Inbound rules is what you want to click here. Click New Rule. Port. Next. Here, you're going to need to specify the ports that you're going to use. I believe the default, if you're just using a single server for Myth of Empires, is 1188. Right here, you'll see it. 1188 for regular server port, and then query port is 1288. So what you're going to want to do, 1188, 1288. And then next, allow connection, check mark all three. Name it, typically what I name it is just like, TCP, uh, let's say Myth of Empires. Uh, TCP is for the kind of port that we're using. So normally you would just hit finish right here. I've already got this set up. I'm gonna hit cancel. Now you need to do this again for UDP. So go ahead and open up the new rule, port. Now check UDP instead. 1188, 1288. Next, allow connection, domain private public, and then I would just name it UDP, Myth of Empires, uh, and then hit finish. And that's pretty much it. You should be good to go. Now, there are like a bunch of server settings. I will go ahead and link down below. Somebody made like a massive document of all the server settings. Very helpful. There's still, I think, some unknown server settings, but still crazy helpful, I will say um but yeah that's pretty much it if you have any questions feel free to comment down below and if you want me to make any more videos maybe showing like some settings how to edit blah blah, blah i will gladly do that thanks